Hey guys, Tommy K here with the little video test that I had promised a while ago, finally just getting around to. It's going to be a Fluke 337 versus a Craftsman True RMS clamp meter. Just to show you guys the differences between the two, uh, the Fluke is kind of the standard that everyone goes by because they're the most accurate and uh, the quickest responding, as you'll see in this video. So the setup is a single 9510 and two Sundown SAZ 2500s wired at 0.7 strapped. Uh, so I'm just going to do some quick uh, little clips here just to show you the differences and see how they respond. Right now I just have them on uh, true RMS mode, not on peak hold, so we can see the differences and how quickly uh, each meter reacts to when I turn the volume. So here we go. You can see eventually the Craftsman does catch up for the most part, maybe a few tenths off of the Fluke, but the big difference is it takes a lot longer to get a reading out of it versus the Fluke. So I'm going to do a peak hold test here in a minute and show you the difference in that one as well. Alright, now i got both meters on peak hold. You can also see one of the big differences already. The Fluke is at 0.2 amps right now with nothing on, and the Craftsman's at 11.5 already. So it's going to take a few clicks to get past that number already, so here we go. difference there. 42 amps on the Fluke, 57 on the Craftsman. That's what peak cold kills on this thing. Because right off the bat it already had 11.5 amps on it with no load, whereas Fluke only had 0.2. So big difference when you're measuring actual power with these guys. That's why I use the Craftsman for pretty much current draw testing only because I don't need as, as good of a number for that and it's just for my own records. But this is big difference so you really do get what you pay for when it comes to clamp meters so all right one last test here guys now I got my uh, fluke 115 multimeter here so I'm gonna do actual power readings obviously everything's on peak volts that's the way I got to test but this will show you how big of a difference this craftsman makes in terms of power it's gonna show a lot more power than the, the fluke is so it's gonna be a full tilt burp uh, let's see, note is 42 hertz. Of course, I got the term lab going too. I'll show you that in a second. So, see what happens now with all three meters going. Term lab is going. Obviously, I can't hold everything at once, so I gotta put this down, do my burp right quick, and I'll show you guys the number.
best score, 152.4, 42 hertz, single 9510. Voltage is a little down, so that's why the score is hurting a little bit, and it's hot as hell out here too. But here's the main thing I wanted to show you guys. So, 102.1 volts, AC volts, 43.9 on the Fluke, and the Craftsman, 61.6. So, I'll have to do the math later, but that's going to be a big difference in actual power levels. So, like I said, guys, you get what you pay for when it comes to this stuff. That's why you got to go with the best if you want to get the best results.